What is up, everybody? White Lighting HBD here with another video. And yesterday, I got a pretty interesting comment from Matt S. And he asked, why does the king always switch which hand he holds his sword with? And at first, I thought this guy was on some Cushmaster 420 stuff, right? Like, this guy was on some good shit. But then, I was like, okay, you know what? I'm going to go on Clash. I'm going to log in. I'm going to see what he's talking about. So, uh, look at this. And I, I discovered this, and it blew my freaking mind. Look at the king, okay? He's holding his sword with his right hand, right? Now, watch this. Watch, ready? Ready? Whoop! He is holding with his left now. He's a fucking shapeshifter. The king is a shapeshifter. Okay, he's holding the king. Holding the king. He's not holding the king. He's holding the sword with his left hand. Now watch this, right? Sword in the left, fisticuff in the right, and he's going to swap it in a second, right when he turns uh, left. And there it is. Okay, again, <laughs> the sword is now in his right hand and the fisticuff in his left. And the same thing happens with the queen. Look at All right, she's got her right hand on the trigger right now. She's running around. Okay, right hand is on the trigger, and the uh, arrows are pointed on the right side of her shoulder, and she's going to spin, and the... Uh, wait, wait for it. And now the left hand is on the trigger and the uh, the little arrows are on the left side so I, I just I was like what okay this isn't game breaking or anything it's not a huge glitch but I just like when I saw it I was like wait has this always happened the king and the queen are shapeshifters like what so that was a cool little glitch that I discovered today but that is not what this video is about this video is about farming now I did ask on Twitter what you guys wanted to see for today's video and I got a lot of requests for uh, for some farming raids and that is what we're gonna do and in dedication of our king and queen's new uh, new shape-shifting abilities that we discovered today. I did train up a bar- We got 120 barbarians and 120 archers. We are splitting it up evenly because we're not sexist. I love both barbarians and archers, but I'm, I love archers a little bit more because I got teddies. But yeah, guys, we're going to go out in the Masters League and do some farming. Now, I did try to farm a little bit earlier this morning with some all archer raids, and uh, the loot was ass. So I'm hoping that we're going to be a little bit more lucky now and uh, that we're going to actually be able to find some good loot raids. But uh, let's go out and search around and see if we can find some raids and stack up some loot in the Masters and fuck the shield. Okay, so we found Hassan, and he has a pretty looted up base. Not that bad. We're going to start off by taking off these outside buildings. Just stuff that we can get out of the way early in the raid so that it's not blocking uh, the raid once we kind of like full on attack this base. And uh, another thing I'm going to look for, because it's a barch raid, are the mortars. Now I kind of, okay, this mortar actually, uh, this is going to cause the most problems because it's the most leveled up. Just kidding, it's a little baby. But yeah, okay, so the he only has two mortars, and honestly, they're, they're kind of far into the base. Well, he's got three. Uh, well, he has four, but that doesn't count because it's a little fucking baby mortar. But he's got three. One's way in the middle of the base, and then other two are not really guarding much. So I'm not going to worry about them. Uh, I haven't barched in a while, so I'm, I'm, I'm kind of rusty. So we're going to throw down some barbarians on this right side, followed by some archers. And hopefully those will be able to get through uh, most of the buildings. And we're going to do the same thing. Oh, jeez. Nobody saw that. That was... Nope. Nothing. That was nothing. That was a pop-up from Twitter. <laughs> get it? All right. So now we're going to put some barbarians and some archers again on the top side. Uh, and it looks like, actually on the bottom, they got through pretty much everything except for, uh, these, uh, these little collectors. So we're gonna throw in a couple more on the bottom. Okay, how are they doing on the top? Top's going pretty good. This bitch Barbarian King, bruh, you trying to fight my Barch? Are you serious? And he's dead. He's dead as hell. And, uh, that guy's out of the way. Awesome. Now we only have really this left side of the base with, uh, the remaining loot. And the Queen, this bitch, is only level 2, so we're not gonna have any problem taking her out. And we're at 35%, so, uh, I think I'm just gonna use the rest of my troops on this side. Uh, because that's where all the rest of the loot is, and that's where the Archer Queen is, and I kind of want to kill her because she's a bitch. Alright, Queen. Get the Queen, but watch out for that Wizard Tower, though. That Wizard Tower is going to cause some issues. Let's put some Archers and Barbs on that. Yeah, the Queen is dead. We're at 40%. We are almost uh, almost done with this raid. Going to put the rest of my troops just kind of along this side because that's where a lot of free percentage is. And uh, here is the 50 right there. 50% awesome. We won the raid, and uh, that's really all that I ever wanted. But we can use the Barbarian King and Queen in this, right? I mean, they're shapeshifters, dude. They know how to win this raid. Okay, so we got a bunch of troops at the top. Uh, let's see if we can go for the two-star, actually. You know what? Fuck it, man. We're going for the two-star. we got a minute left, guys. Can we get the two-star with one minute remaining? I am not really sure. Uh, there are quite a bit of compartments and walls in the way, but I think our troops are going to be able to do it. Uh, I'm really hoping, at least. Uh, this Okay, awesome. King is swinging in towards the middle. Uh, queen is kind of uh, going around on the right side. She'll be taking that archer tower out, so that's good. Uh, I don't know, guys. Maybe the king will be able to get it all by himself because the queen... Yeah, she's going to be stuck on a wall after this, so uh, I don't know, guys. It is up to the king, really, here because the queen... Uh, just chilling on that wall. King locked on the town hall along with some barbarians. Actually, they're all dead. And, uh, yeah, it's completely up to the king right now, guys. 20 seconds left. He is under fire by a lot of wizard towers and a Tessa. A lot of splash damage buildings, pretty much. Uh, the queen coming in for support, coming in for help, and she's gonna be helping out with the town hall. And it is going down! Get it! Yeah! Awesome. We got it, guys. I'm gonna end the battle, actually, before our king dies. And that is a 71%. Oh, man, damn it, we missed a 69. Whatever, 71% and a bunch of loot gained from that raid. So that was not bad. Now, uh, let's go back to base and train up another one of these armies. All right, so we do have our barge trained back up. And uh, this time, our army camps, they're a little bit less segregated. It looks like, uh, 
looks like an, like a, like an avatar orgy, but uh, besides that, we're going to be doing a little bit of a challenge this next raid. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to go for a loot raid because I need loot desperately, but uh, we're going to go try to find a good loot raid, but this time... We're going to see if we can go for the three star because uh, we got a two star fairly easily last raid. Now I want to see if we can push ourselves and push our uh, shapeshifter, king and queen, and the barge army to get the three star. So uh, let's again go back out in the Masters League, try to find a raid, and uh, grab the three stars. All right, so we've searched long and hard, almost as long and hard as this HWD, and we were not able to find a very good loot raid. So I made a decision. We're going to attack this guy for two reasons. One, because he's got a little bit of loot, so his base is uh, pretty good to attack. And two, we not only have 4,169,000 gold, but we also have a total of 69,000 Dark Elixir. So I don't want to do any more searching because this is just, it's perfect. So now we got to figure out how the hell are we going to three-star this guy. Uh, and let's start off by taking out this mortar. I know that it's not going to take out that wizard tower because they're strong as fact. But uh, it'll get close, so that wizard tower is almost down. And then uh, we can do, we can do, okay, let's do a mortar, take out this mortar here. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to damage the uh the wizard tower okay we did a little bit so now we're gonna be attacking from this right side and uh this is how we're gonna do it because it's gonna be kind of hard to three star a base like this uh just because there's a lot of splash damage in it so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a wave of barbarians down all right this is some mlg bart shit right here all right and then a wave of archers and then we're gonna be using our king and queen in order to basically just tank this raid because we want the splash damage and whatnot to lock onto the king and queen and just basically use those as shields uh, as we follow up the rest of this raid with our uh, barbarians and archers. So now, queen going to be shooting on our troops. My troops not having it. This queen is going down, man. She is dead in a few seconds. They're awesome. Uh, so now we got a bunch of troops going in the middle of the base. Let's see if we can get some, uh, basically, barbarians and archers going in on the sides. Get some archers in and take out the uh, wizard towers, especially this one needs to go on the bottom here. And uh, troops are going to be breaking in by troops. I mean, the king and queen are going to be breaking into the middle compartment here, which is awesome. Uh, and they are swinging this kind of bottom way. So what we're going to do is we're going to start basically just uh, placing troops down on the side that the uh, that the king and queen are going. Uh, unfortunately, our king, I don't know where the hell he's going, but the queen is locked on the town hall, so that's awesome. She'll be taking the town hall out. Uh, now we just need to basically distract this mortar and this wizard tower uh, and get them off of our barbarians and archers. So hopefully... Our troops, okay, awesome, dude, the king just broke a wall, then he hit this wall, I'm so confused, what's happening? Alright, now the queen, queen, the king is going to be going after these splash damage buildings right here, which is awesome. Uh, this mortar is going to be taken out by the archers, that wizard tower is going to be going down as well. So now we're going to be building the rest of our barbarians and archers at the top of the base up here, and a lightning spell down. Uh, just on these splash damage troops, or troops defenses, just so that we can help the queen uh, take them out a little bit quicker because they uh, they are causing a little bit of damage. Luckily, they're just locked under the queen. And oh shit, I meant to hit the special ability there. I accidentally touched the lightning spell. Uh, awesome. So the queen special ability used. Uh, it looks like she's probably not going to survive the rest of this raid uh, because this archer tower is kind of. Wait, nope, she's got it. Yeah, save yourself. Yes. All right, awesome. The queen is still alive and she is going to see the end of this raid. She will survive until the end of the raid. And there it is, guys. 99%, 100%. We got it. We got the 100. I said we'd go and get it. This base was a bit easy, but it's okay because we still got it. We got the 100, which is awesome. So uh, we just destroyed Mahdi. Now uh, let's go back to base and regroup after that raid. Okay, so that's going to be it for the barge raids. Now, hopefully, next farming episode. We'll be able to actually spend some of our loot because as you can see, I'm just trying to save up for these uh, level 3 P.E.K.K.A.s. I got a late jump on them. I know I only have level 2 P.E.K.K.A.s. I'm a noob. I'm sorry. And I also am trying to save up and uh, basically max out my cannon. Well, not max up, but get them to level 12. Uh, just because they uh, look all red and shit and really cool, and I kind of like how they look. But yeah, guys, that was just a really chill farming video I felt like doing. Uh, I haven't done a farming video in a while, and I'll hopefully be able to resume uh, a farming to max series once we get higher up in cups, and there's actually loot, unlike Masters League, because loot was really shitty today. But yeah, with that all done, uh, let's get to today's common question of the day. All right, so today's common question of the day comes from Spartans Crew 7 and he asks, if you could add one new thing to Clash of Clans, what would it be? Now, this question, uh, to be honest with you, I would add a new Dark Troop, because or a new hero, one of the two. It, it needs... The game needs something more fun and more exciting, but I already talked about this last comment question. Now, what I wanted to do with today's comment question is I wanted to open the comments up to you guys, and I need your guys' help. So, uh, what I need you guys to do is think of uh, the, the coolest things or whatever you want to see added to this game, whether it's like uh, clan tournaments, whether it's a new hero, a new troop, a new spell, or uh, new additives to this game. Whatever you guys think would be really cool to add on 
to Clash Clans, like basically update ideas. Go ahead and throw those down in the comments. And uh, for a video coming up pretty soon here, I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna pick out the, uh, the basically the best ideas that I found uh, and make a wish list video, uh, an update wish list video with your guys' suggestions. So uh, I'll take your comments, I'll put them up in the video, and I'll basically just talk about you know how I think about the idea, or, or I'm just gonna make basically a video, a wish list video using your guys' comments uh, as ideas for the uh, new update because there is a new update coming. Uh, it was hinted at by the name change thing, so I'm really excited for that. So uh, whatever you guys think would be good in a new update, go ahead and throw that down in the comments so that I can pick it uh, and use it in this video. So yeah, guys, that's today's comment question of the day. Uh, shout out to Spartans Crew for asking that. If you guys want your comment question of the day answered in next video, make sure to throw it down in the comments for a chance for it to get picked. And yeah, guys, that's going to be it for today's farming video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you have not already. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter, follow me on Instagram. All that is in the description of the video. And I love you guys, and I will see you in the next one. Peace. The pretty girls in class still They never reply But never say never They never get caught on my mind I'm trying to get better and grind Measure my effort and skill Gets better in time Fresher than ever And I am who I am No taking it back I'm alive and well